because I started off in the UK uh, doing FM uh, 18 months ago now and now we've managed to move the whole family to Cyprus. Put our son into a Greek school over there, he's doing really well speaking Greek. Um, we've just changed our lives, totally changed our lives. We've, we've moved from, a, from England over to Cyprus and that's around Myself, my husband do FM and we've took our three kids with us. I've got a four, five year old little boy, Harry, and we've got little twins who are 10 month old now, little J Jalen and Aidan. So we took our th uh, whole family, there's five of us, um, uprooted to Cyprus. FM's really changed our life. Um, I've got a nine year old and a five year old and two 20 month old twins. Um, FM has meant my husband, who was in the army before and a lorry driver, um, had the chance to leave work and join my FM business. So now we work together, uh, we bring up our children and we have a great income coming into the house. Um, we can have nice luxuries, go on nice holidays and most importantly spend more time with the children without having to go to work. Um, it's a worldwide business. So I, I got paid anyway, never had to go out and find a job, which was the best bit, because we could go over there, we could view houses, we could you know, jump in the pool, go to the beach, and we still got paid. And all we had to do was support our team. I started FM last November, so I'm just coming up to my first anniversary. This is my first conference that I'm at today. Um, so not long at all, it took me three months to get to Pearl Orchid. And I worked very, very hard. It wasn't handed me. Um, I had a lot of help from um, people above me, sponsors, um, an upline, um, who helped me get where I am now. Some people come in, they jump in and out, they might try it for a week, oh, it's not working. But it's not going to work in a week. When you go for a waitress job, and it takes a week or maybe a month to train up. If you go for an office job, it might take months, maybe a year to even move up the pay plan. Whereas in, in FM, you can, it can be weeks, months, years, it doesn't matter, time's not an issue. You can at least you give it a shot and give it a try. Um, so FM gives us a chance to have our adult time, to socialise with people. Um, and although it's work, it still seems like fun. It's almost like a game, um, bringing people in and yeah. helping people. Yeah. And, um, and it's kind of a game looking at your figures and let people play PlayStation games and the other you know, aim is to get the most points. FM works in exactly the same way. Somebody joining, uh, say someone joins your team tomorrow, they can actually come in and earn more than you can just because they put a little bit more effort in and it's not structured in a way that you know there's only ever one winner, the person at the top. It's everybody can do it and the, the opportunity is there for everybody and when you're in a job you're always filling a dead man's shoes, you've got to wait for them to be given the boot, you've got to wait for them to die, you know, you're literally filling a dead man's shoes, whereas this, we can easily, it's like cat and mouse, you can just say, right, you've got that, I'm getting that this month, and, but you're in the same team, so, you know, it, it's just good that you can, you can earn whatever you want, and there's no cap, and you can overtake those that introduce you as well. And the goals are really realistic. There's um, no other companies that you can join and be able to say in so many months' time you're going to get a car. Um, when I first joined FM and I said there's a fantastic opportunity that I'm going to be a part of and I can get a car and I can get a free holiday and I can get all this money. And my friends said that, uh, you know, I think it's a scam. Yeah. I think it's that no one's going to give you a free car, Rachel. No one's going to give you money for doing minimal work. And no one's going to let you stay at home with your kids and, you know, have financial freedom. It just doesn't happen in this world. But it has, and we've yeah. proved it. Hey, bosses. Can't stand bosses. And it's a good opportunity to work for yourself, flexible hours, work as and when you want. If the kids are ill, it doesn't matter, you know, you just can put it down and say, right, I'll come back to that next week. And if you've built a good business, you'll still get paid anyway. It's just pick it up and put it down whenever you want. People can achieve stuff that they couldn't achieve in a day-to-day -day life, couldn't achieve having a nine-to-five job. They can't achieve, you know, you might have a family that no qualifications, um, stuck at home. We've got people in the team that are disabled. Mm. Uh, we've got... We've got numerous amounts of people that couldn't do a nine to five job, be it a mum, disabled, no qualifications, no job prospects, and there's just no jobs out there. And it's actually being able to give these people a chance. And that's, that's a beauty in itself. We actually, it's great seeing them get up on stage, get cars, you know, get 
certificates just for getting to a certain level in the business and seeing their excitement, which boosts our excitement. But the beauty of the business is we we make money for helping people make money. So it's a win-win situation. Mm. So we we obviously thrive on helping people make money, but it does you know benefit us as well. We get to make you know extra income, but for helping other people make income, it's madness in a in a job. It's yeah, you know it's people trying to clamber over each other to get to the next position, you know, and backstabbing each other and all the office politics. We just all help each other and next minute, you know, you, you're all succeeding. You've got to have a big reason why. You've got to have a good enough reason. Otherwise, it's just, there's no point in having it. I know for myself, it's a giving a better life for my family, um, giving them things that I might not have got when I was growing up. I, I, I had a, a, a good childhood. Um, I, I did get things, but I'd to offer my kids that a little bit more and I'd like to you know be able to give them the life that you know I'd like.